It's the 18th day of the Electronic Games Advent Calendar project. Yesterday we did Pest Control when we played Whack-A-Mole, but let's look behind door number 18 and find out what game we're building today. And we have a green LED. And today's game is the reaction test. To start the game, we have to hold down the left button as we turn on the power. When we do so, the LEDs will light from left to right. As soon as we see the first LED illuminate, we have to press the right button. If we're fast enough, this will stop the game and it will play a tune. But if not, the game will restart and we'll get another go. Let's see how we get on. Well that took a couple of goes, but we did eventually manage it. But the game actually has an extra bonus feature. Let's see if we can make that work. This time I caught the game just as it hit the final green LED. Now it will pulse the yellow LED. We can adjust the speed of this LED by using the left and right hand buttons. Now the pulsing is much faster. To get back to the game, all we have to do is press down the left hand button while we press the reset switch. So this is a super challenging game, but a great way to test your reaction speed and hand-eye coordination. There is, however, a way to cheat. So let me show you that now. So by holding down the button, the microcontroller gets stuck when it's testing for a key press. This means that if you bounce the switch fast enough, you can actually win every time. Nevertheless, I think this is a really fun game and I'm going to get some more practice in. But if like me, you're excited to find out what's behind door number 19, make sure you're subscribed to catch tomorrow's video. And in the meantime, why not check out my retro electronics and vintage computing content right here on YouTube.